Hey guys, Bing here. Today I'm going to show you a, um, how to model this mansard roof. Okay, so create a project. Yep, so first, let's draw some wall. W A. Okay, so go to 3D view and. Uh, Select all this wall. Let's let's make the um, um, stop one level. So a uh, level one. So that's the wall, and then we can draw some roof. And uh, at level one, okay. Pick wall. So usually I like to use pick wall. So pick all the wall, and select select all the edge. Define slope, which is Good, and maybe 70 degree, and then overhand, um, maybe 600 overhand, and okay. So now let's change this move to a little thinner. Okay, so if I go to elevation, so you will see that actually the because of the overhand it go down about here. So if you log, you can move this up to. Yeah. So maybe some we can move that up. Yeah, it's up to you. So okay. So so the next step is we need to uh, find the level this this line. Okay. So in here I'm going to just draw a level. You can copy that up. Um, let me guess three meter. Okay, so level two. So and then select this roof, and uh, here that's a uh, cut cut off level. Select level two. So you will say the roof's being cut. So it's actually cut here and go up a little bit. So yeah, so you can just adjust this level to whatever you like. Okay, so now the next step is to draw another roof. Okay, so and then this time pick line. So you can just pick all these um, face of this roof, and then so select select all these edge, and then this time I'll change maybe twenty degrees, and then okay, and of course I need to lift this roof. So go to Elevation, you can just change to wireframe WF and then move this roof up. So now, if I go to 3D view, and this is it. So, this is a roof, but sometimes it's a little bit like because we, we have two roofs here, and sometimes when we change, we might uh, need to move one roof up or down a little bit. See, it's all. Uh, not only the shape, but also uh, not only the level, the height, but also the shape. So you need to adjust them. But that's another way. Once you have these two roof, so you can you can you can do a model in place. So if you can just combine these two uh, shape, so you can do uh, what you can do is model in place, and then choose the roof, and okay, and then sweep. Pick path, so so you can pick this edge, and then okay, edit profile, pick line, this one, this one. So you just and then you need to uh, depending on what shape you want, you can. I'll, I'll just quickly draw a rough draw a shape, and then this go down like this. And okay, and okay. So now I'll use HI. So this is the new model in place roof. So we create. So this is one piece of roof. So um, yeah, that's uh, that's that's pretty much it. So um, you can either use two roof with a cut off, or then just create a roof uh, using model in place. Uh, if you have any questions, just let me know and I'll see you next time.
finish. Okay.